The PolyPro 3 RV cover from Classic Accessories has many great features. First, please note these tension panels on the front of the cover. These straps act to tighten the cover around your motorhome or trailer to reduce flapping in moderate to heavy winds. Simply pull on this end until the strap is taut. You will also notice that your cover comes with a number of non-scratch D-rings with which you can secure your cover in extra high winds with the included rope. Simply attach the end of the rope to the included toss bag and throw under the machine. You may have to repeat this process until you get enough of a lace pattern to secure your cover. For easy access to the interior of your RV, please note the zippered panels on the sides, front, and rear. If you wish to get inside your RV while covered, these panels make it easy. Sharp corners and exposed ladders are the enemies of RV covers everywhere. This is why all PolyPro 3 RV covers have reinforced corners and ladder caps to bear the extra strain. Please be sure that your corners are lined up with the reinforced patches and that your ladder has the cap installed to avoid unnecessary tears. Also, all PolyPro 3 covers come with storage bags for use when your RV cover is not being used. All PolyPro 3 covers come with excellent service through a three-year warranty through the manufacturer, Classic Accessories. Thanks for taking the time to learn about our covers. It's a significant expense, so make sure you do your homework. We're confident you'll find that a Classic Accessories cover is the best tool for the job. Making sure you get the right size cover for your RV is the first key in getting a snug, lasting fit. We get a lot of questions on how to measure the RV, like where do I start from, where do I end, does it include the tongue, the ladder, or the bumpers, and should I go for a snug or loose fit if I'm in between sizes. Start with the initial length measurement. Measure your RV from bumper to bumper. For those of you with trailers, measurements do not include the ton of the trailer. This is an especially common question with pop-ups. If you have a storage area in front of your pop-up, include that in the measurement as the cover will fit over those fairly well. The other variable to consider on your RV, especially with a Class A or 5th wheel trailer, is the height. Most models are around 120 inches or 10 feet tall, measuring from the ground. This would be fine for a standard cover. Some models, however, are what we call extra tall and are 144 inches or 12 feet from the ground. Many people ask what to do if they're right in between sizes. Say with the 25 foot RV and the sizes available are 20 to 24 and 24 to 28. It is usually best to have the tightest cover possible to reduce wind damage. So keep in mind that cover manufacturers like Classic Accessories are conservative with their measurements. For example, a 20 to 24 foot model is actually 25 feet long. So if your RV is truly 25 feet long from bumper to bumper, you should go with the smaller size. Another common question is whether buyers need to worry about AC units when calculating height, mirrors when calculating width, or ladders when calculating length. The short answer is no. The manufacturer has taken these exterior parts into account when manufacturing the cover, and it will be full cut to accommodate any and all of these parts. Hope that was helpful. Many of you have asked about the best way to install your RV cover over your motorhome or trailer. The RV cover can be installed by one person, but we recommend using two people and making sure you have a tall enough ladder to safely access the roof. The cover is folded so that when you unfold it on the roof, it is in optimal position to drape over the RV. Be careful up there, it's a long way down. Here it's important to get the sides to fall down at the same time, or thereabouts. You don't want one side to fall down first as it can drag the whole thing off the top. Now we'll make sure we've got all the loose fabric unrolled and in the right place. Now we just need to make sure the cover is tightly secured. Add cardboard to the corners to protect against tearing and then use the tension panels like this. Be sure that the corners stay lined up. While it can be a bit of work, getting your cover on is a lot easier if you think ahead. Remember that when you put the cover away after using it, Rolling it up the way it came from the manufacturer will save you a lot of headaches. Also make sure you wear non-scratch shoes to keep your roof in great shape. For most people, an RV is the second largest purchase they'll make after a house. Make sure you protect your investment with a cover from Classic Accessories. Mm -hmm.